setting up user roles and permissions in FastTrack Cloud. The menu button is located at the top left portion of the FastTrack Cloud connector. Entering the setup company and, and security setup area, specifically user security permission setup. A administrative user password is required to enter this area. Once into the area, you will likely uh, see a blank screen with the exception of the administrator login required to enter the program and you've already set that password that's what allowed you into this area. You can start as you see in this area you can add users, <coughs> edit users, delete users, edit permissions once a user is created and also you can control network MAC address filtering and what that will do is allow you to filter out either people that are you're allowing to use the, the product from remote locations or limit uh, the MAC addresses that can access uh, the cloud product. Um, I, in adding a product, uh, I've already added a user here, but you would add a username, uh, first name, last name, email address, and the type of role uh, that that person plays within your organization. I've already added one called test real quick here. And uh, this test user you can see is a dispatcher and in, in looking at, we want to edit the permissions of the dispatcher. You can see the dispatcher has three different types of permissions that are by default granted for to them. If I want to look at the other types of permissions that I might grant to this level of person, they are these types of things. I can certainly go in and, and uh, grant others uh, by going to add and uh, grant other permissions to them as well, as you can see. I can, uh, once granted, I can deny access to that specific area as well by clicking denied. And that is how you add, edit, and uh, create users in FastTrack Cloud.